Allison, who can count the years more than those in love? Our life together has only begun, and as we begin this new part, I wanted to thank you for the best times and the worst. It's because of these that we have grown together and become what we are. It's because of you that we have grown so close because of your patient and hardworking nature. So let's start a new countdown today. Here we are, day one. Love, Ryan. Ryan, happy wedding day. I can't believe the day has finally come where I get to call you my husband. I hope you're holding up well and not freaking out at near panic levels like I most likely am as you're reading this. In the past month especially, I've been fantasizing about how every moment of this day would go. What would go wrong? Who would be late? Or what would cause me happy tears? Spoiler alert, it's going to be seeing you. I'll only be figuring out the answer to those questions today, but the one thing I've never questioned is my love for you. After all the planning and stress, you have been my rock and I'm so lucky to have you by my side. Babesy, you are the world to me. Thank you for being such a loving, respectful, goofy, adventurous, and all around amazing partner. I love you so much and can't wait to see your handsome face staring back at me as I walk down the aisle, maybe with a tear or two. Your almost wife, Allison. We are here to witness the most important event in the lives of these two people. Ryan and Allison, I remind you that your love and loyalty are the foundation of a happy life. Allison, I knew I loved you from the moment you walked in the band room our freshman year of high school. Even though I've told you a thousand times or more, you still don't seem to believe that was true. But today, now, on this day, you can finally understand that I have always loved you. And seeing you, <coughs> and seeing you stand and tear in front of me, I realize that I am falling in love all over again. My promises to you may be simple, but our love is complex, and I will always enjoy seeing it change and evolve over the years to come. T to me, this day feels just as it did many years ago in February of 2007. <clears throat> it's love at first sight and will be for the rest of our lives. Ryan, I wrote the word breathe in my book here as a gentle <laughs> reminder to myself to remember to take in what a special moment this is for us both. I can't believe we're standing here in front of all of our closest family and friends on our wedding day. It was like yesterday that I met you in our high school band room on my first day of school in Arizona. Twelve years later, here we are about to become husband and wife. Loving you has always come so naturally to me. When getting to know each other, we became best friends first, but it didn't take long for me to realize that our bond was something special. Whether it was flirting with each other at band camp, reuniting at ASU, and eventually, or eventually moving in together, I've always been so drawn to your humor your willingness to listen, and your overall outlook on living life as an adventure. It didn't take long for me to realize you were my person. Oh. 
You are my forever, my best friend, my dream come true, my babesy, my shoulder to cry on, and I'm so excited to finally call you my husband. I vow to always close the kitchen cabinets after you leave the room. <laughs> <laughs> Though I can't promise I won't continue to nag you to close them on your own. I promise to always stick by your side, no matter what challenges come our way. If we are blessed with children, I vow to be a loving mother and to work effortlessly to let you be the cool dad. With the authority granted to me by all those here who love you, Allison and Ryan, it gives me great pleasure to pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. Ladies and gentlemen, please let me be the first to introduce you to Mr. and Mrs. Ryan Connolly. <laughs>